G'day everyone, Bellame here. And so is Derek. And welcome back to Tangle Tower. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect because we just Finally, got... Finally, we get to investigate a murder in a spooky mansion. <laughs> there you go. It's not that spooky, really. Don't mean this. <laughs> so go. welcome back we are super excited to be playing this again literally we are so hooked to this we just can't wait to get back to figure out more mm -hmm. hopefully you're all enjoying this as well it's just it's one of those fascinating gotta figure this oh, out oh yeah the mysteries de yeah. definitely has you uh and it feels like a good idea to play this as consistently as possible considering you know it's a mystery it has <laughs> it has been a little bit since we played the last time yeah so hopefully i think we'll be i think fuzzy. we'll be all right though yeah so i was thinking so let's by talking to i forget his name i thought it was fitz but i don't know yeah we have this room unlocked, All the or names, we could start going to the pointers. The names are going to be a problem for me anyway, just because I'm bad with remembering that kind of stuff. But yeah. Yeah, the gardener. We definitely talk to the gardener. Mm -hmm. um, so we could go to his room, but I really want to learn about the pointers at the same time. So I'm like, uh, what do we, we do? We can do the pointers. We got to do it all, all eventually. Right. All right. Let's see if anyone's in here. <gasps> the music room. Is that Poppy? I That might be Poppy. I think it is. But of course, we gotta check out everything for yep. us first. We gotta click on everything. All right, you got your wish. Spooky murder mansion. <laughs> Spooky murder mansion. Nice. <laughs> I'm glad I clicked on that before. <laughs> yeah, that worked out. Oh, whatever it is, it's playing a little trumpet. While it is the music room, he's gotta practice. <laughs> What's with all the broken glass? Ooh. Oh yeah. Maybe there was like a light bulb or something in there. It has the same crack as the uh, oh, gramophone yeah. as well. And or maybe the, the cassette on... too. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. There was a fight. <laughs> All right. You got oh, the there it is. Okay. Okay. I thought it was the music. I know. The... the paper. I thought so too. Who plays the violin, I wonder? It's pretty dusty. I so guess. I'm guessing nobody. In a long time, at least. Yep. One old wooden bookcase. Yep. 25 dry old books. With candles <laughs> right next to them. Uh-huh. Four lit candles. <laughs> Why is he yeah. talking like that? Am I the only one seeing the problem? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I saw it. Yeah, yeah, you did. I did like you? how there's plants That's in there. It's just daylight, right? Mm-hmm. What else would it be? Yeah, what else would it be? It I'm confused. Like a forest in here. I'm not sure. Ooh. <laughs> I like that. It's a globe. For globing. <laughs> For globing. Globe trotting. Oh, spooky spooky murder. Murder. Okay. Well, I'd, I'd say the piano. Uh, but there are bugs up there, the but. Lids. What's that? There are bugs up top, oh, I don't but think I don't think there's any. Yeah. Yeah. Don't touch it. <laughs> Why not? Might be haunted. No, <laughs> That'll work ah, on him. So they, she's played Super Mario 64. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's talk to her. Okay. Whoa. Oh my. Are you a ghost? Why did Sally, the music have to go scary? Well, oh my is, gosh. She is. It may come as a disappointment, but I am alive. Ah. Uh, that <laughs> makes you a suspect, I'm afraid. Oh. No. What's your name? My name is Poppy. Oh, I'm so this a is Poppy. And a pianist. We'll need to ask you a few questions about. That's an interesting design. Hers? Hey, yeah. I like it. Pretty good. All in the wrist. No. I mean, proper wrist placement. Practice. Yeah, that's <laughs> more like it. <laughs> I was about to say, proper wrist placement is important, but <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> it's the practice that'll do it. All right. Whoa. I'm just me. There's nothing to know. How are you related to the other pointers? My father is Percival Pointer. The professor spends most of his time hidden away in his tower. All right, so the professor. Hmm. He's one of the ones that the found out of me. Yeah, because that was everyone was worried or not worried, but like Fifi and Freya are my closest friends. They were like saying he's never around, and we saw him. Do people ever leave Tangle Tower? That's a good question. It's just if you're nineteen, you don't have to answer that, Poppy. It's a fair question. I'd like to move away, definitely. Fifi, Freya, and I would often talk about it argue about it freya hmm. wanted to leave but fifi things are more complicated for her what about now after what happened i really don't want to stay here much longer 
Hmm. I'm not suspecting her much. No, I'm not either. I didn't really suspect yeah. her to begin with. Hours of piano practice. Soon as I wake they up, mentioned her so much, it was almost like they were pushing it. Half. Does that not hurt your hands? Sure. And you no. do this in the music room? No, I prefer no. to practice in my room. When I make mistakes, I like to make them in private. What did you do? I can that? understand that. Yeah. I was supposed to meet Fifi in the library, but I totally forgot. When I finally got down there, she'd already gone. I checked her bedroom, but it was locked. Was Fifi not in there? No idea. She keeps her door locked either way. So I went back upstairs and out into the moonlight garden. The what? The little garden on the roof outside my room. Was it just you up there? No. Fitz came outside after a while. Okay. Yep. His room's on the other side. He's yep. been teaching me about flowers. So, did you talk to him? Not really. You ignored each other. I didn't say that. <laughs> huh. Just hmm. very quiet. Here we go. Very quiet. I love these statements because they give you a visual. The moonlight garden most mm -hmm. of the afternoon. Then we heard this sound. It lasted about three seconds. I've been trying to decide how to describe it, but I'm struggling. It was huh. like something drilling into a piece of metal. Uh. The heck? Worse. I was pretty sure. That's it was scary. Yeah. Tower. So we went up there to check. She is scaring me, locked. honestly. Her was segment here. I knew mm. Freya and Flora were both supposed to be in there. So I made Fitz kick down the door. <laughs> I went inside. That's fit. Freya that was fits. <laughs> Flora was in the room too? Yeah. I think she realized what had happened at the same moment I did. Oh, whoa. I didn't know what to do. So I ran downstairs to get Fifi. Her door was still locked. But I knocked and shouted at her. Eventually, she let me in. The lights were off, but I could see she'd already been crying. I hmm. told her what had happened. Hmm. She didn't believe me. She got angry. First time I've ever seen her angry. I dragged hmm. her out into that the hall. That makes her feel more suspicious to me. Yeah. Too, for some reason, the three of us went back up to Flora's tower. Then Felix arrived. He had Penny with him. Fifi had this idea. We just need to be Penny and the she professor. To do some kind of scientific test. She took me down to the library. We were in there about 15 minutes. After she was done, she went back upstairs and I went back to my room. That's it? That's it. Hmm. I, hmm. I feel I feel like the the statements are starting to be slightly I feel something's mm. off. I don't know. I can't place it at yeah, this moment. Yeah, we only have two more But I, to meet. my gut feeling is telling me Fifi feels more sus than before. Yeah, that's for sure. Oh, like, boy. is there some weird thing going on with Needless the inheritance? And tongues expel, unless within the mouth they dwell. The spoken word unfit for dealing with the shifting form of feeling. What is this again? Asking face, about Flora. Oh, okay. And soundless space. Wow. Okay. That. For God. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's gonna be one of these for each one. Days a shadow seeker past. Is it bravery or surrender? Accepting that your world will render nothing darker than the gloom. Some four walls make round a room. Wow. Hmm. She's pretty uh perceptive. Yeah. I guess is that the a word? Silver spoon. A story written all too soon. Huh. The chosen dwelling of her heart. Unjustly chosen to depart. Lost her liberation lays in the center of a maze. Okay. Huh. So she got to choose her room? Is that what that was about? Like, and and yeah. spoon? Yeah. Silver spoon? Meaning she ate, like, mm. very... Yeah. Yeah. Very privileged, right? that's what it usually means. Yeah. did in the waters be the orchestrator, pale and still, pulling strings, enacting will. Well, she okay. seems to be casting the most doubt on Hawkshaw. All right. The orchestrator. Yeah. Head, but free of mind, unimprisoned, unconfined. With starry eyes, she sees beyond, behind our walls, beneath our pond. A oh. soul untied. It's hers. It's free. Was then, is now, will ever be. Hmm. Wow. 
So it sounds like she wanted to leave or was like, yeah, Freya, she was Freya, actually Freya looking outward that, and everyone else was looking inward. Yeah, Freya's the one that actually wanted to leave. Fifi yeah, did not. Fifi didn't. But it was complicated. Why? Softly yeah. does the flower grow. All in time and time is slow. Rest a seed within the earth, but do not rush its gentle birth. Hour by hour, day by day, tune your heart to nature's way. Hmm. That's no. me. I'm on a list of murder suspects. Always thought that would be kind of cool, <laughs> but it's just tedious. This tedious. Is short, doesn't it? All right. Well. <laughs> oh no. So there are two families living in Tangle Tower. Mm-hmm. Three pointers and five fellows. Okay. Four fellows. What's oh. the connection mm. between them? There isn't one. Not really. What about the it middle family? By the Remington family? Yeah, the Remington. Yeah. Or as a Remington, originally. So was Primrose, my mother. She married into the pointers, and Flora married into the fellows. So the fellows and the pointers own the house now? Flora owns the house. Depending huh. on who you ask, that means her husband Felix owns it too. What about your father? His claim over the house kind of fell apart after my mother left. Mm -hmm. Left? Now. No idea. Oh. Who's the oh, other? Oh wow. Who's the other woman? I completely. I thought that was her mother. W uh, which other woman? There's some. The other oh. pointer. I don't think so. Knife wound. Hit me. Huh. From what we could tell, the blade went in at an exact right angle, perpendicular to Freya's body, and there's okay. only one small pool of blood. Nothing on Freya's hands. Or anywhere else. Yeah. The whole thing is just a little too peaceful. Suicide? That seems so I not can't like imagine her. suicide. From what everyone's described her, that doesn't yeah. seem like this is mine. Really? No, well, yes, it was. I gave it to Freya about a year ago. What was on it? Nothing. It was blank. Freya said she wanted to record something. Any hmm. idea how it hmm. ended up underwater? Maybe someone wanted to destroy it, but got really lazy. No. So she wanted to record something. Maybe some kind of evidence? Maybe? Why don't you make the statue? I know that's the only harp in the whole of Tangle Tower. I've never actually seen a real one. Maybe it's from before your time. Oh, definitely. <laughs> See how old this statue is? What about the symbols? One of them looks like piano keys. That's true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Weird. Uh, hmm. huh. She kind of brushed that off Don't quick. Think that's weird, yeah. But the letter isn't addressed to anyone or signed by anyone. Someone's being deliberately secretive. Yep. Or they're trying to manipulate you. Or that, yeah. Yeah. I wonder if the letter has something to do with Hawthorne being invited. Maybe. When I first saw it. She is searching for something. Like yeah. Was holding a knife with blood on the tip. You don't think that anymore? No. It was a stupid thing to say. The room was dark. I was in shock. I'm just an idiot. But it was blood on the tip. If you hadn't said anything, maybe Fifi wouldn't have checked. Exactly. It's stupid. But we would have missed out on an important clue. Is it a clue? Really? Tell yeah. me how it's a clue. Tell me how it helps. Uh Nothing about the knife makes any sense. It's just freaking everyone out. I should have never said anything. Wow. Mm. Okay. What was inside? Interesting. Nothing. Huh. I wonder poison. Do you think poison? It was my mother's originally. I don't originally. think. So I don't know. Why is it up in Flora's room? She just gets the most use out of it. Freya would borrow it too sometimes. Hmm. Does this belong to you, Poppy? Now that's not really my style, is it? <laughs> but who not else really. would own a tape like this? Literally anybody. I mean, you could have made it for her. <laughs> I guess it does make her seem but really bubbly. To Felix, I think. Yeah, I but know, but wasn't. like when you give a gift to someone, it's for the person, not for you. Was that supposed yeah. to be Flora? Possibly. Oh. oh. Nice. <laughs> I think everybody sees something different. Did yeah. Freya ever tell you what she saw in it? Not exactly. She said something about it being from a recurring nightmare. Oh gosh. Hmm. Sorry, but if it was from a nightmare, why would you paint it and leave it in front of your bed? 
<laughs> wanted to take control of it. Giving Ooh. it something of physical form can make it easier to deal with. Well, sometimes. Hmm. Hey, that's me. Not a bad likeness. It looks <laughs> like you're standing in a rose bush. Is there something wrong with that? <laughs> Guess not. That belongs to Flora, I think. All right. Oh, All sweet. Right. <laughs> Some All of them right. are short. This diary. I'm sure I've seen it in her room before. That's where we found it. Have you ever read it? Do you know what's written in there? I'm what? starting to wonder about Fifi. I'm sure she would yeah. appreciate me invading her privacy. I thought you and Fifi were close friends. Yeah, we are. It's just Fifi's gotten kind of impatient with me recently. Do you know why? I'm not sure. I'm sure she'd tell you if you asked. Oh, she would. She'd give it to me straight. Probably why I've been avoiding it. Hmm. hmm. I don't know. I, I think there's a lot of pieces know. that come together. I don't I don't even know if it's just yeah. one person either. No, it's just it <laughs> yeah. looks like something she'd use, don't you think? Oh, you've been to the greenhouse? What did you think? Uh, impressive, I guess. <laughs> But kind of unsettling with Fitz lurking in the shadows the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> he does that. Don't look at me. I didn't break it. Does <laughs> anybody else use the music room? Yes. I don't know who, but I can tell when somebody else has touched the piano. Hmm. Don't look okay. at me. Whoops. I didn't break it. Does anybody else? All right. All right. Poppy's bedroom is unlocked. I wonder what's in there. Should we head there now? Uh, either there or go to the other guys, but I guess this can be her day, so let's let's head over there now. Okay. There's her room, right across. Yep. It's definitely on theme. Yep, that's for sure. <laughs> How do you even get drapes on the ceiling like that? That's, that's a good question. A real mystery. Because those drapes are heavy. <laughs> Yeah, it is. Anything in the wardrobe? Dresses, mostly. I never realized there are so many shades of black. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Empty. Pile of clothes? Just a bunch of clothes on the floor. Nothing weird about that. To you. <laughs> mm. More handwritten sheet music. An eye oh the yeah, there is the eye. Ah, yes, a giant symbol drawn in chalk on the we floor. We saw that eye on the ceiling. Oh, a good omen. Did and we? Flora's. Remember, oh, yeah. I saw it after the recording. It's an eye. When I was editing, I was like, "There's an eye on the ceiling." Hmm. In Flora's uh, tower. That is the just like that eye. Yeah. Interesting. I thought vampires slept in coffins. This is a vampire who needs firm support for their lower back. <laughs> that is. I thought the, vampires. This is a vampire who needs firm support. Oh, thank goodness. There are seven lit candles. <laughs> Wouldn't want it to be dark in here. Seven horcruxes. Anything in the drawers? <laughs> Nothing you need to know about. No, jeez. Oh, wow. Gloomy. But roomy. <laughs> God. Her There's own piano. A name for this kind of piano. I think it's an upright piano? You know, these ones that stand upright. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Sheet music. Presumably for piano. It's only a few notes. I oh, I wonder if it's going to be that same theme. Yeah, it's been framed, though. Must be Ooh. important for some reason. Let's see. I think it. I think it is the same. Do 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 do. For what music? Do, do, do. Remember, like, um, what we've been hearing the whole time from the birds and oh, from yeah. people humming and all that. I it's wonder if that's this. the notes. Hmm. No, it's not. It has six I think legs, it was like doo, 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 or something Some, like that. Something. Yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> Sextopus. Wow. I mean, that's how you would say it. Yeah. Various handmade posters. What do you think those symbols mean? Yeah, hopefully, nothing. It's more of the eye thing. A big glass door leads out into a garden. Is that Somehow. a giant lock too? Looks There's like it. There's a little mechanism by the handle. Oh. We got our puzzle. Yep, I figured. This we'd... is how we're gonna get into the garden, the moonlit garden. Slide it open. Oh, oh no! What is? What do we have here? Okay, move the tiles to the correct slots. All right. Is there anything underneath any of them? Hmm. 
Maybe we have to have uh, all the suns showing? I don't know. What, what's Maybe your take? Or I don't move them all to it? Nothing. Still all not. Four tiles have a moon symbol. And those other symbols look like suns. Surely that's something to do with it? I think it is, but in an abstract kind of way. Hmm. Oh boy. I'm not so great with abstract, so. Yeah, I'm uh, not sure on this one. I'm just gonna meet each one to move each one to the left. Also, it's weird I can. Uh, okay. Hmm. Maybe the information we need isn't here. Oh, my okay, guess. okay. Somewhere else. Yeah, I don't. Right. I don't think we have the info for this okay. one. Okay, I guess we'll come back later. Yeah, let's see later. Cause I have. I really don't have any idea. Yeah, I on got that. no clue. Unless it's in the room somewhere, but I don't know. Okay, let's go over to um that guy's room. Yeah. You want to go to Fitz's room? Yeah, let's go ahead over there since we opened that up last time. All right. We'll go to both sides of the moonlit garden. There you go. Oh my God. Whoa, that is empty. This is uh. Oh wow. Scary. What? It's a big empty space. I don't like it. I do not He's like very it. This is creepy. Bones. Quit sulking. Not every room is going to be full of clues. <laughs> I'm with you heart. on that one. Yeah, what's that card? Is it from... It's um, a little handmade card. Someone's drawn a heart on the front. Freya, Inside maybe? it says, to Fitz, oh. from PP. Poppy? Poppy? They're in a relationship. Yeah, are they? They are definitely in a relationship. Because they were like in, the thing, in that room together. Mm -hmm. Looks pretty healthy to me. Healthy, but sad. Is it because it be outside. Freya found out about it? I nah, don't it doesn't know. seem like it's an empty plate. Looking at it is making me want to cry. Why? I don't know. I don't know. This it doesn't look soft. This is giving me some heebie-jeebie. Not hidden very well, is it? Doesn't need to be. All it's right, locked. let's check it out. Let's see if we can figure this it's one out. Oh my. Lock. Sort okay. Of. All right, can we move those Rearrange puzzle pieces piece of around? paper to find the combination for the pen. Okay, so they make shapes. I see that already from... I can't rotate it, so... Oh, you can't? Okay. Then, yeah, move them around a little bit. See if you can match up those jagged bits. Yeah, I think that goes there. And then I think the other one goes on the left. Maybe. Nope, not the left. Yep, right there. You have to move the others over, I think. Uh, let's see. I wish we could rotate it, though, because I feel like that's not... Okay, so you can't... Yeah. You said you can't rotate it, right? Is there a button you can press? That will... I'm pushing other buttons, but nothing. Okay, alright. Uh, so we're gonna... Huh. I don't know which one to start with is the problem, because right now we got that three-leaf one. Let's see so, what they say. Nothing. Maybe if you move the paper around, you'll find a clue. They probably match up in other ways, too. Yeah, that's what it seems like in this case. Yeah. Alright, let's see what else we can make. Mm, I don't think it's that. The lines don't match up too well. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is annoying. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Do you see something? Yeah, it was one. Oh! You don't actually have to line up the, the cracks, is that what you mean? Yeah, it looks like it's more about the lines. Oh wait, now it's... Okay. Oh, gosh. Yeah. But that doesn't match up with the lines perfectly either. See, from the pink to the brown, there's other lines that don't match up. Yeah. And I don't think there's a leaf that... Oh, actually, there is a leaf that shape. Yeah. So... So... What color, though? Yeah, now... Now's the question of, like, what's the order? And which one comes first? Because the first one we saw was that... Actually... Three-leaf one, like that. Here's the thing. That shape is not here. Which one? The shape, this shape we just made, this shape is here. Yeah, that one is. Okay. So I think it's still, it's all, each one has their own unique shape. Ah. There's no repeats. 
Okay, so now we just need to find others that kind of make shapes similar to what we see here. Wait, what's the last bit? I was with you until that last bit. What do you mean? Basically, each shape in these sets yeah. are unique. So none of these shapes that are in this one are in this one. So if we find other shapes uh, that match these, uh -huh. that's, the, that's the one we need to pick. So, like, we so found... So, so we that's not the answer right there? No, 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 because we only found this one. So we oh, need we to found that one, too. That three-piece that three piece up there. This... We the, did? There was one that had... The very first one we saw, it looked like either that one or the one on the bottom. I don't know which one. Uh, uh, can we recreate it? Let's, uh, let's, let me try to recreate it. It was... See. Not that. That's the one you just did. Um, the pink is going to be on the right, I think. Uh -huh. um, blue is going to be on the left, and yellowish is on the bottom. See that the three clover, the three leaf. Oh but yeah. But let's see what the bottom is. Is it pointed or is it round? Okay, it's pointed. So it's that one. That one that we got there. See the green one? Yep. Okay. So these two are good. We need to find these these two. Okay. Um. So let's see what else we can make. You already got that one. Yeah, I did. Okay. Let's move this over here and see if there's any way to match this up. Oh, there's the leaf oh, right yeah. there. There's the, the cut up leaf. Okay, let's but move I, this up. But we have to see if it's um, rounded or pointed. It looks pointed. So it's the green one over there. Yeah, this one. Yep. Okay, and then the last one. Um, if we have the pink on the left, what does that rounded shape make? Does it make that long, fat one? Uh, let's do, find out. Do you see that one down there? The teal, the one with the big bottom, the wide bottom? So it would be pink yeah. is on the left bottom. No, no, like, see pink. Oh, I see it, see it. Look, um, pink and blue together to make that rounded bottom. And then put that one on top. It's that. That teal one on the yep. bottom. Okay. You're right. So scroll it. Nope. The other way. That one. That's, That's it. Done it. There you go. Yeah, yeah. We did it. That was different. We got it, though. Anything in there? That's kind of cool. Yeah. yeah. Cloth. Hold on. Huh. That's kind of ominous. Uh-oh. Oh, I don't boy. like the sound of that. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Yeah. They, they, yeah, they're definitely a couple. Okay, then. All righty. All right. All right. Interesting. Huh. Also, another lock. <gasps> <gasps> they, they match up. They match up. And they... Thought we were halfway up a tower. Oh my goodness! Scandalous. They, they yep. would meet on the rooftop to hang out. What if it was uh, them? What if it was those two as a team? Yeah. Take... Okay. So here's where all yeah, the moves go. Okay. That. Yep. We need so, to remember. Okay. Hold on. I'm gonna take a picture. <laughs> Okay. Because I'm not even gonna. Because I don't remember where it was in the other room. I'm just room. literally gonna take a picture. I mean, it's not too screen. hard to know this pattern, but yeah. Just in case. Let's come back once we know what. To... All right. Cool. All right, let's get out of here. Go back to the other room. Yep. Getting things done. This that, is really. Yeah, that worked it, out. Oh my gosh, this game is so intriguing. A big I gotta know more. Leads out into a garden. There's a little mechanism by the handle. That's crazy. Okay, so put this, put the moon, um, no, not on top of the sun. Yeah, next to it, and then. And this alternating uh, pattern. Yeah, but move it up one. Yeah, and then there, and one more. There we go. Try right. that. And then uh, take a picture of that because we'll need it for his side. Oh right, for the suns. Yep. Okay. Something happened. Oh my gosh. Nice. That's crazy. And the door's still locked. Then you gotta do both. I yep. still feel like we made some sort of progress. We did. We made progress, for sure. All right, Man, back this over. is just so... Yeah, there... interesting <laughs> yeah. lineup there. Huh. Alrighty. It's I gotta know more. Like, I I'm even more are. intrigued I now. Know. It's like, hmm. Because they're, I guess they're cousins? They might. We have to take a look. Uh, yeah, we have again. to look at the family tree. But all right, sons go. 
top next to the moon and then um, below right yeah and then the two bottom that isn't that one <laughs> my descriptions are horrible but yeah no, I, I saw the picture <laughs> it made a noise I guess that was right yep let's do this come on finally it's open there we that, go they had to Whatever's both open the outside, better be worth it wait okay there we are let's see what's in here oh it's beautiful the rooftop garden I would love being here honestly okay we got music we got frog thing we got some water a little balcony this is really gorgeous mm -hmm. birds it's the door into Fitz's room one of only two ways to get into the garden yep oh, yeah. these are the only two ways so that so this could definitely be used by the two of them to like Giant travel between dog. the towers Love to it. make it look like they're not suspicious as well maybe that's another thing yeah he's got his tongue out like he's catching snowflakes uh, except those aren't snowflakes they're feathers feathers Ooh, more feathers none of the feathers that were yeah from the inked bird yeah interesting but he uh, wasn't Fitz doing some kind of research for seeds, and they were. Maybe. It's got to do with the bird. Uh, the water feature. Maybe he was doing sneaky, research on a sneaky. seed to grow a flower, Wonder and he was having issues out. with figuring it out. And I think they were it's trying to figure out seeds bench. for the ink dip. Two-person bench. Now, what yep. makes it a two-person bench specifically? It looks pretty standard to me. Uh. <laughs> it's a rose bush. Growing on a little patch of bluish soil. That soil, yeah, that special oh, soil. Yeah. On one side, the whole thing looks very well cared for. And wasn't there a picture of a rose? It, it, her in a rose bush, yeah. and Freya drawing them. The roses are yeah. red too. Maybe Freya found out about the relationship. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Like she found out, and they were yeah, like, aren't not roses normally that color? Exactly. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just a dumb joke. A little pond. It looks really, really deep for some reason. See those metal bars around the edges too? Metal bar. Oh yeah. What are you supposed to have Metal bar from the noise Nothing she described. Anymore. What Maybe. if it was just fit? Looks like somebody broke them. Remember the aquarium in the main them. floor down below? Yeah. <gasps> there was a monster in there that broke out. <laughs> I don't know about that. Statue doing a really bad job of hiding in the bushes. He's got He's his headphones on. This time. He's also wearing headphones. Well, they're not part of the statue, and they're not headphones. They're earmuffs. Ooh, mm. earmuffs for the iron work? For doing metal stuff? I guess. Oh, so interesting. I see an egg pillars. statue back there, too. Or what's left of them. Yeah, yeah something. OK, so that's kind of broken, egg too. statues. I don't get it. Why eggs? Birds? Well, either they have some special significance. Yeah, birds. Oh, the sculptor was just really lazy. What do you mean? An egg has got to be the easiest shape to make. <laughs> Come on. What if uh, one of the it's eggs so was like relaxing. an actual I might mythical creature? Oh, shall I go finish the investigation on my own? I don't know. Oh, that'd be great. Click on some of the birds if you haven't already. I will then. The door into Poppy's room. So only Poppy and Fitz can get into the garden? Huh. I guess so. Where are the birds? Uh, in the tree. See their little heads popping oh, around? Oh, yeah. Trees. On a roof. In a garden. Mm hmm In a garden. On a roof. I don't see anything else well, other than the bridge. Oh, good. A bridge. I'm <laughs> glad to know there's a way to get across that tiny, tiny pond. It's cute, <laughs> though. It's Bridges pretty. Bridges about getting across stuff. But also... Is it significant, like a bridge to gap the statues. two families? I don't get it. Well, either they have spot those. Maybe. An egg has got to be the easiest. Um, leads up towards Flora's Tower. Interesting. All right, I All guess right. that's everything. That's pretty much it. We got a few clues that we can offer up to people as we go along. Yeah, we got a few more things to but look at. But I'd say before that, we have these two rooms to check out. Yep, but, but that's the end of today's episode. Um, oh my gosh, I am so... Let, let's see I what these know two more. are. I'm so hooked. Jane, dang it. This just makes me want to keep is, going. I think it's a family tree. All right, yeah, let's see how this goes here. All right, so here's Poppy. Poppy and Fitz is over there. So they... So, Hmm. I'm really bad at reading these. You're, yeah. you're going to have to help me out here. 
So, so Flora... Poppy's mom... Yeah, is Poppy's mom sister is... sister of, of Fitz's... No, uh, not even... No, Wait. so... So here's Flora. Fitz's Flora. family is... Oh, F Flora had Fifi. Yeah. Right? No, Flora had... Yeah, Flora and Felix had Fifi. Fiona. Yes, yes. Um, okay. But... Felix's brother, so, Flint, got together with Emily. So, okay. other than the fact that they, they are, like, second cousins or something like that, because they're... There's no direct... Fitz, Fitz's aunt. I guess the rep, they are related by... Yeah, Fitz's aunt and Poppy's mom, or Ooh. sisters. Okay. So, it's not a, it's not a very close. I have, it's, like, hard for me to wrap my head around, because it's, like, a little bit crooked. Like, I have to go up to get mm. to Felix. Because Flora and Felix are together. So, Poppy's mom is mm. married to Felix, and Felix's brother well, no, had Pop Fitz. Poppy's mom is married to oh, wait, Percival. No. Oh, right. Poppy's mom is the sister of Flora, who's married to Felix, and yes. Felix's brother Flint had Fitz. Had okay. Flint. Fitz, yeah. Okay, yeah, so All it's right. not super close. No, it really isn't. Uh, and when there's you know only so many people around of your age, so I guess I, I don't know. It's so interesting. I yeah. gotta know more. And also that aquarium thing, there's got to be something to that because that leads right up to uh, the that so little lake. I think weeds in there. It just seems like it. Weeds and sa weeds and sand. Yeah, any more as mm. well as a clue. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I can't wait for next one. Hope you all are excited too. I can't wait. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. This is so much fun. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thank you so much. And a huge thank you to the supporters of this show. We really appreciate it. I can't wait to come back. <laughs> all right. Talk to you all soon. Have a good one. Take Bye. care.